All right. Well, now we're going to move on to uh, because we were talking about back to school. Uh, thank you, as always, coworker Aaron, as like the day of the day before, as I text you and Kevin in a panic. Well, guess what? I didn't think of a game, but uh, I know uh, back when we did Dustin versus Lund, uh, Kathleen, one of our well, was a listener. I don't know if she still listens or not, but a teacher made like a little bit of a fourth grade test for you guys. So we're basically all going to do that again. Yeah, I uh, Googled, are you smarter than a fifth grader questions? And oh. I then copied and pasted them onto my phone. Is this Canada or U.S. version? Uh, it is, I didn't pick anything that was uh, original like okay. that. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. you're fine. That's yeah, one thought there's an Arctic region of Alberta. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm the one ever to make a mistake. <laughs> yeah. Maybe that. But yeah, yeah, sue me. <laughs> all right. So wait, this is a, obviously, Aaron, you're going to ask a question. We're all going to answer on our whiteboards here. Um, the loser we decided, uh, just now talking about, uh, t- it doesn't have to necessarily be a picture with a giant pumpkin, but someone has no. to do a nice a photo, <laughs> especially because these, these firefighter photos are getting pretty tired. It has to do a nice photo shoot in some kind of fall, like basically like an Ann Gettys or the Gruber baby. Yeah. As, as you put it. <laughs> yeah. it no, I want to see a sleeping man in a pumpkin patch. Yeah. 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 Something like that. They, like, we'll, we'll we'll find inspiration for the photo. I remember my sister used to collect those photos. So I know exactly uh, what we're in for. And uh, because this is basically, are you smarter than a fifth grader? But uh, yeah, we, we got to avoid copyright. So this is, uh, are you more intelligent than a, t- than a young Element 10-year-old? T- yeah. Yeah. Oh, yes. Okay. Yeah. Working title. Oh, yeah. Pop, pop and pills. Mints. Mm, yeah. mm. Have another. In one. Amsterdam, they have smints, and they were my favorite. I actually, I had, <laughs> I had smints when I was in Europe yeah, too. See? And when you're really drunk, it's the funniest name you've yeah, ever seen. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Smints. Um, but okay. So we we know what we're doing. How many questions are there? I've got twenty five. How many oh, do you actually want to do? Well, I think ten. Yeah. Ten. Yeah. Okay, ten, best and then of we ten. can roll into t- tiebreaker if there are two people tied. For, I'll see the or, loser in a pumpkin is just, patch. Is it just ten questions? And if three people are tied for loser, three people are in the <laughs> yeah. pumpkin there. patch. Yeah. 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 Question number one: What is the process of water turning into vapor called? Water to vapor. Oh. Water to vapor. Also, all of these, you're like. You're going to be mad when you don't get them. <laughs> the, <laughs> One's like. already mad. Okay. Uh, I think I'm right. I'm going to go first. Uh, evaporation. It, in fact, was evaporation. 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 Nice. Everyone oh, got oh, it? Oh, it took me a while, but I got there. <laughs> you got there. Yeah. All right. Well, every, everyone uh, has one point. What does a paleontologist study? This is a bit of a trick question. Hmm. Interesting that you would say that. I thought so i'm gonna lose half a point from the the game master for this answer but that's okay okay well i said uh because she's gonna be one in like a month uh aaron's one of them fossils good answer ted fossils i said dinosaur bones slash fossils oh i said bones come on kevin said bones i didn't know you could have two guesses i'll give you fossil give him half a point no if you you shouldn't have said it was a trick question, yeah, I think I, we all would have put. I would have put there. dinosaurs for sure. All right, that was a, that was a gimme. So Lund Lund is behind by one point. What are the three states of matter? Three states of matter. I think we're smarter than you're giving us credit for here. You might have to. No, not Kevin. It. <laughs> <laughs> I think you've stumped him. He probably did put down also, yeah, North Dakota, South Dakota. You should Dakota. be smarter than a fifth grader. Yeah, but like when we did the fourth grade test, like that stuff, oh, that, like yeah, the regions and all that. A lot of those that, are very specific forget. about I, like yeah. memorizing clouds and trees and dinosaurs. Yeah, I tried to make it somewhat accessible yeah. for you guys. All right. All right. Solid so, liquid gas. Yep. Solid liquid gas. Yep. Oh, solid no. liquid vapor. Oh. <laughs> See? Like, what is that third one? <laughs> okay. Smarty pants. Oh, no. A oh. word, phrase, or sequence that reads the same forward and backward is called what? Oh, it's called a f*** you. <laughs> That's okay. a, yeah. oh, what is it right. called? I remember when we first learned that race car was the same and they thought that was the coolest thing. I was playing the, that game backwards where you would say the words backwards mm. and I kept being like, rack a car, rack a car, is, rack a car. Is and it then easier I, than Mad Gab? <laughs> <laughs> you don't look so sure, Lundy, so maybe you go first. I'll say anagram. Nope. That's not a bad. Yes. That, that's what I had I as well. I also had an anagram. Yeah. 
How about a palindrome? Take your uh, light. What, what's an anagram? As soon as you said anagram it. Anagram is yeah. where you like rearrange uh, the letters uh, of the same word. That was a tough one, Eric. Thought so. Here's uh well, no, let's not go there. Uh which blood type is known as the universal recipient? Recipient. Mm-hmm. I have no idea. <laughs> I said B plus. I said A B. I said A B positive. O negative. Lundy gets it. A B. <laughs> is it A B? Yeah. Oh, you're A B. No, it's, no, that's, it's that's, that's the most rare. I think. You're A B. Is it? Oh, I yeah. think so. Isn't, isn't it? So am I wrong? Because I put a plus. I think so. Yeah, you're way off, buddy. But A B, he didn't have a negative. What's the? No, he's A B. A B is the answer. A B. A, B. Yeah. Uh, I'm not even sure you can be A B positive I'm, I'm or negative. I'm trying to learn here. I think it's just A, B. Okay. So I've got four. Lund has three. The athlete has three. Walsh has two. I also took these off the internet. If they're wrong, it's not my fault. Riley, look it up right now. (laughs) Universal blood type. Please. Well, no, she said recipient and not recipient. donor. Yeah. I think O I think O is the o donor. Is donor. Is a donor. Oh, okay. That's okay. So yeah. I was in the question I was answering, I was right. I just didn't listen. All right. I'm asking this one because of Jean Claude Van Damme. Oh, oh yeah. I'll know this. Universal soldier. Yeah. What's the capital of Belgium? Ooh. Oh. I mean he's a piece of shit, but if you know his nickname, you know the answer. Just, I know I know this because of that episode of Friends. That's what I was trying to remember. Mm-hmm. Was that? Oh, his other nickname was Wham Bam Van Dam. Oh. Right. <laughs> All right. I said Brussels. It's Brussels. Yeah, yeah the muscles okay. from Brussels. I didn't say you, Brussels. You, oh, my you were goodness. One had chocolate. That was like a cap. total guess on my part. I couldn't. Wow. I was trying to think of Brussels. I, just, I almost put Bruges, but. Oh, no, that's what I was trying to think yeah. of. This is that movie. In Bruges? Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, the muscles from Brussels. Yeah. What type of animal can live on both water and land? Ha, I know this. Is it, like a, <laughs> is it the name of an animal that can or like a very specific? Or like an animal type. Animal? No, it's like a like a category of animals mm, ah. that can live. Okay, yeah, yeah. In land and on water. Kev, you go first. <laughs> amphibian. Correct. It is oh, an okay, amphibian. Then. I.e. Mermaid, mermaid or merman. Okay, but which half of the fish? <laughs> also, I don't the mermaid know. mermaid or merman. Can they wow. live out of the water? If you have a magic... Uh, you just got to sing a song about it. So All right. That's seven questions? Sure. Yeah. So I have six. I have four. I five. Four. Ooh. Two little boys in a pumpkin patch. We got... We got, we got, we got, we got. <laughs> hey, hey, you want to tag team this? <laughs> okay. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> which is the fastest bird on foot? Uh, I total. I think it's an ostrich. It's it an ostrich. is an ostrich. 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 Yeah. Look at you. you. Guys must know birds. This is very too. confidence yeah. building. Yeah. Those roadrunner birds are pretty fast too. I almost put that yeah. one. They're very small. I didn't realize yeah, how small yeah, they are. Tiny. They made it more look more like an ostrich in the cartoon. Yeah. Very mm-hmm. irresponsible drawing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I was actually surprised the first time I saw a road one. Yeah. Runner. We I saw one. Like, we no. saw one catch a a bunny though. Oh. Did you see a coyote catch a roadrunner? You never will. <laughs> never. Yeah, you're right. I don't think yeah. I see it. Can't be done. All right. You guys need Strybosh to draw. We were just ball. tied, and now you're no, you a point ahead of me. I, I thought we got that right. Yeah. Yeah, you have For you're five. five. You drew the line. <laughs> yeah. See? Okay. Just checking. Jesus. <laughs> Let's go math. Oh, no. If a shopping cart contains one apple, two bananas, three oranges, and four hot dogs, what percentage of the cart's total contents is fruit? One apple, two bananas, three oranges, four hot dogs. Percentage Stop of fruit. Stop yelling at me. <laughs> so it's okay. like what Ted gets at Costco. It actually does sound like my shopping cart. Fruit and wieners. Why did I have to call? We were talking about that. Like, why Why can't they just call them hot dogs? Because wieners pretty funny. Yeah. yeah, okay. Wieners better. Yeah. Good problem solving. <laughs> did you draw? Did you draw it out? Yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I, I, I drew the shop. I drew it. the shopping. You cart. drew yeah. the shop. No. Did you? Oh, I was just saying. <laughs> if you did, you have to show your work. Sixty uh, percent. Yeah, sixty. Sixty percent. Yeah. All right. Come on. Okay. Come on. Okay. Ask a hard one, Aaron. Yeah. All right. Ask a hard one. Well, last one? What do you mean hard one? You're losing. Yeah, but I wasn't trying it. You guys are smarter than I gave you credit for. What planet is closest to the sun? I hate space. <laughs> <laughs> Would you rather be trapped in space or at the bottom of the ocean? Oh, space for sure. Yeah, I agree. 
ocean so terrifying. scary we don't yeah, know anything about we don't know anything about the ocean no. don't mess with the ocean man. No. did it's... anyone else get anxiety when you see like deep videos of deep yeah. trenches oh. i can't watch like those people that like free dive no oh. that's no, that's you. crazy no like what's the point no. we have I, the technology now. i'm gonna go as far as i can and i'm gonna pass out yeah i can't even watch movies about submarines freaks me out makes me feel claustrophobic oh. itchy Not what was sand- the question sandwich <laughs> 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 All right. What's the closest don't, to the sun? Don't tell him because he doesn't know. And this oh, is yeah, big. no answer over here. This Anyone else big. sing through the whole Sailor Moon theme song to remember all the planets? What? No, I didn't watch Sailor Moon. No. Oh. No. Oh. All right. Mercury. Mercury. Earth. Oh. <laughs> it was Mercury. Oh. How do you know that? Because everyone knows that. So now I got to do this photo shoot by myself. Yeah. That's 10. Yeah, you do. Right. Earth just cost you. <laughs> Oh, dear.